Hello guys and welcome back to another VMBNP video. So uh, today I'll be uh, showing you the best battery saver which is available for us. Okay. So here we go. The first one is the this one, this battery saver. So uh, this uh, Antitu battery saver is uh, by Antitu as you can see. So uh, this uh, battery saver what it does is it does not let your device heat up and uh, plus it saves a lot of battery okay so uh, uh, it it won't uh, you won't feel there's a there's a lot of difference in the starting but as you keep using it you will realize that it's actually helping you and the second you uninstall it you will realize that it actually made a difference to your device okay so uh, at first you might not notice it but when you uninstall it you will realize that it actually made a difference okay and the uh, what it does basically is it reduces your performance a little bit it's very unnoticeable and uh, when you turn off your device it, it's got this uh, feature I'll just show it to you see uh, as you can see it's got this uh, settings and uh, see auto airplane mode during night mode night to save more battery control screen brightness control CPU frequency and uh, it sets it also sets up the default CPU frequency so in the night mode it uh, enables after you enable the night mode it will automatically enable uh, um this airplane mode so uh it'll it'll save a lot of battery okay trust me i've been using it from a lot of time now and it's actually helping me to save a lot of battery okay so this was one and the other one is this it's called bs battery saver both of them uh, require you to uh, be rooted and uh, battery saver requires you to be rooted but the ds battery saver also requires you to have exposed installed it's available on the play store it's also available on the play store and as you can see right now it's off but if you put it on slumber it's always in the deep sleep while the screen is off so uh, uh, as you can see that as soon as you turn off the screen it will switch off your data it will switch on your wi-fi and it will it will do a lot more things which uh, uh, as you can customize it here see you can customize it here it, it does a lot of work and uh, and they do not take a lot of ram they are not hungry battery savers as uh, which are available on the play store see as you can see i'll just show it to you see running see ds battery saver it's taking 22 mb right now because uh, we had opened it earlier so we'll just close it this both and uh, go back and close settings and then check it again and you will see that they take up to 5 MB or 10 MB max see as you can see DS battery saver was taking 9.8 MB it usually takes up to 10 MB max and uh, the battery saver normal one it takes 5.6 MB so uh, this is what happens okay guys so uh, this is what uh, and if I'm using the both the battery savers because when the screen is on and when I'm using the phone, the Antutu battery saver helps me to save battery. But when the screen is off, the DS battery saver helps me to save battery. See, it needs uh, this and it also requires you to have exposed installed. Those of you who don't know what is exposed, you can check out my other video on exposed especially. Modules, as you can see, DS battery saver, it's here. So this is how it works and uh, if you want to save a little more battery then there is this app called Amplify. Yeah. You have to just open it and uh, just let it run. It will do everything for you. You do not have to do any settings, nothing. Just have it on your phone. It does not take up RAM at all. I'll just show it to you. As you can see here, it does not take up RAM at all, but it saves a lot of battery. Yeah, so that's it for now. And uh, and guys, both the battery savers are available on the Play Store. And uh, you can and I'll uh, leave a link in the description below so you can check them out. Okay, thanks a lot for watching. 